But here we are now, guys. We're at Brixton Station. Lovely. The vibes of Brixton. Wicked. You can't beat it. This is the High Street now. Brixton High Street. Lovely. Let's zoom out a bit to get a nice nice wide angle view here lovely the sight and sounds of Brixton so I'm just walking around in Brixton here oh this is wicked here. look at this some nice fresh meat here Lovely, lovely. Look at this. This is the hive of activity part of Brixton Market. Wicked. Beautiful place. Lovely, lovely. Alright oh, brother. How you doing? Yes, yes, if you want anything, come to this place. It's got the most stuff. Yes, this is Brixton Market. And I'm looking for my friends. But what I'm doing at the moment, I'm just walking around, having a look at what's in those are shops. I haven't been to Brixton for years. Oh, there they are. I haven't been to Brixton for years. And it's nice to come down. Here he is, it's my brethren, Dev. Yes, my man, what are you saying? All good. You're all right, yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is Market Row. Organic and herb. Right, this is the market area. So this is, yeah. Wow, yeah, this is the market area. We're just walking around. We're still looking for where the Black Farmer's shop is. So we're just looking for it at the moment. Uh, there's a few shops that are closed. Oh, here it is. Wow, we found it. This is it. This is it. This is the Black Farmer. So we're going to have a coffee here. And see. Here it is, guys. This is the Black Farmer. Come to support. Come to support. Absolutely wicked. And this guy works it. Sorry, my friend. And when did he actually open it up? Do you know? December, so it's obviously quite recent. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so it was open in December. So this is a recent acquisition. So yeah, let's go inside and have a look and see what produce he's got here from his own farm. So uh, yeah, he's got sort of a soap and perfume section. And uh, yeah, he's got it laid out on a farm theme and he's selling let's have a look what he's actually selling so it's a mixture of obviously off the shelf stuff or things that you'd buy in a normal shop as they say but obviously he has his own produce from his farm so something like this this is goat and uh, obviously I presume it's made by his own, uh, the black farmer, yep, yeah, that's it. Made from his own livestock. So, yeah. Right, let's have a look at what he's got here. Beef mids, 550. Prices are all kind of the same as what you get in a more conventional supermarket, as they say. But, uh, oh right, look at this, he's got his own patties. Veg patty, dal patty, and fish patty, and all the other ones he got. So obviously here again he's got his own produce, which is obviously come from his own factory. So he's got his own sort of stuff here. Really nice. Oh, some of your juice there. <laughs> But yeah, but with the food stuffs there, obviously he's got obviously things that you can buy. As you can see here. And you've got a lovely cow. Look at that. Mm. 
<laughs> That's not feeling. He's even got his own box. Jeopardy, the danger of playing it safe on the path to success. <laughs> that sounds good. Maybe good reading for me. If you want to succeed, always good to get tips from people who have, huh? Alright my friend. How you doing? You good? Not too bad, my man. So we we decided to come down here and support yeah. support uh, that. the new shop as they say. Yeah. December, so it's still new. That's it, still new, and people are still finding out. Because yes. we just saw a guy doing a video as well, yeah. and we said, "Oh, it's open." Yeah. And then we said, "Oh, let's come down and do a little video myself, and uh, yeah, promote, promote, as they say." Let's have a look here. So he's got oh, lots of seasonings as well. We get a lot of seasoning. Alcoholic beverages if you want some. Yeah, that's lovely. So yeah, there's a mix of everything here. Yeah? Looking at some oh some scotch bite stuff. I have to get some of that. I have to try one. So yep, I'm gonna have to get one of these because obviously I'm sure this is made by who is it made by? Growing up uh, as a Black British Caribbean in England, every traditional dish is my yard. In my yard was packed with flavour, which inspired me to pass on this tradition. Yes, Steph. So we're just looking at this, he's got all his own crisps as well. There's Wilfred Emmanuel Jones there on his farm, I presume, breaking up some things. Yes, that's nice. Yes, it's nice. You've got a little area here where you can buy, you know, coffee and a, you know, coffee, tea. Etc. Cake. Yeah. 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 But what I want to get, I'm going to get a scotch bonnet pepper. I want to try this one. Green chili and spinach. Right, okay. We've got some nice stuff here. We've got different names stuff jalapeno and pineapple. Wow, that sounds nice. So we're going we're gonna to have a coffee with that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have a coffee. Something. See what's over here. This is sort of like a patty, is it? Ooh. Right, what you have? I'm gonna Saltfish order patty, up. chicken patty, jerk chicken patty. Ooh. Spice beef. Well, I'm going to take a spiced beef patty there, tell you that. <laughs> and this is a little chill out area. A little workspace that people can sit and relax and whatever. Let's have a look at this side here. So if you come in, we came in from the main entrance, but let's have a look at the other entrance. See where this leads to. Let's have a look. Right. So this leads to this part of the market. Yes, bro. How you doing, my man? Thanks. Yes, yes. So this is the other side. All right. Were we here before? No, this is another bit. Another meat shop here. But yeah, this leads to the other side of the market. So yeah, you can come in through this door, which is not as grand as the other door, obviously. But here's the market street. So if you walk in on the main street here, and then obviously opposite William Hill, then obviously you've got the smaller entrance to the Black Farmer shop. So let's go back in here. 
so you can walk through here and it's very peaceful as I said earlier it's only opened up in December really? so it's relatively new yeah 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 you want to grab something and a patty what are you having Mark? I'm going to have a spice grab us a spice uh, beef then to it I'll have a spice hold up so that you know which one you got Let me go upstairs. So this is the stairs. We have a look, which is very nice. Look at that. Orange chocolate. Yeah. Yeah. What? We are eat some cake. Have you got orange chocolate? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Them's going for the cake. Huh? Pops him, isn't it? I'm gonna go upstairs and have a look quickly. What's here? Let's have a look. Lovely. Oh, it's so nice and warm. Wow, look at this. It's a cold working space. Wow, that's lovely. Warm, because all the heat's coming up, but very nice. Very nice. These guys are coming up with the. Oh, they're bringing the drinks up here. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, warm up here. Nice. Yes, Marky. Just alerted to my attention. Look at this bottle. Black Farmer bottles. Look at this. Have you noticed something? I'm going to show you this. Look at this. Have a look at it. It's all made out of doors. Old doors. That's great. That is a great use of uh, stuff that we would, would have been thrown in the skip or something. <laughs> lovely, lovely recycled stuff that looks really nice. And have a look at this. This place is hireable as well. This room is available to hire seven days a week. So you just scan that and you can hire it for an event some sort really good and it's got a nice ambience especially if you've got this whole area and uh, yeah good stuff sorry guys I nearly finished it before showing you this wonderful patty very very tasty lovely meat inside great lovely lucky I didn't finish it before showing you now for another bite mm, lovely right I'm gonna try some cake how was it, Dev? Lovely. Right, my turn. Right, there it is. Ooh. Mmm. Very good. Lovely texture. Mm. You know what? I'm going for part two. Mmm. <laughs> What's that doing? Right, what am I going to get? I'm going to get some. Oh, no. Oh, no. Only one left. Only one, okay. Let me get, yeah, yeah. But chicken patty, I think I'll get. No, these are nice. Yeah, yeah, I'll just stick to these, Deb. These are lovely. And let me get one saltfish patty. Cinnamon bun. Ooh. Wicked, no, ma'am, you have to bring some back. I have to bring some back. Bring some back for the kids and Jem. You need to get the Chris there. Let me get a natural sea salt. Let me get the luxury hand cooked gluten free black farmer natural sea salt. It's nice, isn't it? Proper leather. Hey guys, look at this. You know why this is costing 171 pounds? That's proper, proper leather. No messing around with that one. I think that's it. What else is there? What else should I get, guys? Uh, not sure. Well, this is enough stuff here. Hello there. I'll take all this, please. Oh, 
Wow. Well, I just about got the last beef patty there, so I was lucky to get one. <laughs> hey. Gonna let some other people taste it, eh? It's <laughs> not all for me. That's not for me. <laughs> yeah. Can make more. yeah, of course, of course. Just a bag, Mark. Yeah, thanks. Great, thanks, bro. Hello. Right, that's great. Thank you very much, sir. And we'll see you another time. Thank you. Oh, my friend, good luck, yeah? All the best, yeah. Lovely. Not too bad, my friend. How you doing? Yeah, it's got some nice fish there. Oh, it's much more lively than when I was here before. Yeah, that's it, somewhere down there. Yes, yes, it's that way. Yeah. Uh -oh. yeah, man. Feeling the vibes there. and loads of you cannot go short of buying fresh fish meat vegetables everything here there are so many shops here selling foodstuffs you can't look at that, another fish place so many Everywhere you go, selling prawns. I just bought three kilos of prawns the other day. Three kilo. So. Yeah, just bought three Yo. kilos of prawns. Oh, are you all right today? <laughs> Why shouldn't I be all right? Are you all right? <laughs> the conversation of Brixton Market. Eh? <laughs> Conversation of Brixton Market, lovely eggs. Look at this. Oh yes, some lovely goose eggs if you want it. Free range farm. Heritage blue. Wow, yes, yes, yes. Eggs, eggs, eggs. for you guys to have a look at it in memory of the servicemen and women from Africa and the Caribbean who served alongside the forces of the British Commonwealth and her allies during World War One and World War Two. Lovely. At least they've recognized or they've been recognized and this is the inscription on here I'll just scroll along slowly for you guys to read at your leisure. Yeah? 
get this bit here as well. And I'll just scroll along and give that a read. Even I'm going to read it later. I'm just videoing it now and I'm going to have a look at it later on. Wonderful. And when it comes around to poppy time, there's loads of poppies here. I've been here once, but I didn't film it. I just, this is a few years back. But there's loads of poppies there and they call it black poppies. What they're black poppies to represent the African and Caribbean service men and women that sacrificed their life in World War One and Two. And I've got a couple of those poppies. I bought them online and I've got some medals as well from the Black and Caribbean regiments back in the day. Uh, I've got them at home. So uh, yeah, great stuff. Okay guys, hope that was interesting. That's another part of Brixton. Sights and sounds of Brixton. <laughs> hey, that's one sound you hear quite regularly, I bet. Brixton O2 Academy now. That's a famous landmark glass from the past. Yep, that's there still. <laughs> 